Hi, this is Saev Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Hello everybody, welcome to the technical analysis of the Forex market from the ForexPSMA.com. This is the daily research that is dedicated to the euro currency and as usual we will start from the daily time frame. Well, yesterday we said that probably market could show some retracements since there was some reasons for that, for that on the intraday charts but that retracement uh, should not be very deep and that was also the nice context for the potential enter on the short side of the market since major targets now stands, still, stands, st st still stand below the market. So that has happened after the solid plunge that has happened a couple of days ago. Well, market has shown some shell retracement to the upside and continue move to the downside. Well, that was really nice context for the Jordan Apple bread and butter sale pattern. So now, you, now you can see that market uh, continue move to the downside and approaching to the our target that stands around 132.42 area. That is also the 88 support 132.67 from the whole swing to the upside. Okay, you can see that market almost without any respect has passed through the 786 support, has broken it and continued to the downside. In general, if you will take a look at the nature of this price move, you see that uh, bears are really strong. So you can see the strong plunge down, shallow just 3 8 retracements, again strong sell off, 3 8 retracement from the whole swing. Now, no, not even the 3 8 retracement, just shell consolidation again plunge down. So, currently, re a lot of uncertainty about the debt crisis in the Europe because major three economies can come to the agreement about the issuing of the debt. Uh, so, uh, if, you, if you know, the uh, Angela Merkel is uh, stands against the uh, issuing of the Eurozone bonds while uh, they come, can't uh, come to the agreement with the Sarkozy and the new Prime Minister of the Italy about how they will attract the capital to uh, uh, resolve the problem, debt problem in the Europe. So with this uncertainty market, uh, that market usually doesn't like, well, the pressure on the uh, euro is continuing. That supporting uh, situation for the dollar, and you can see that dollar is currently highly appreciated to the uh, in price, and your currency, your USD peer, uh, continue to decline. <coughs> Although uh, on the daily time frame we see the nice bearish context, on the intraday charts there is not so unclear. Situation is a bit more uh, tricky. Uh, let's take a look at the uh, four-hour time frame. Well, that is our butterfly that we have discussed in the beginning of the week, and currently it almost has hit 1618 targets right here, 133 sharp that we have discussed yesterday. Uh, that was our 38 retracement from that swing down that we discussed yesterday. That was the uh, perfect uh, area to enter on the short side of the market, and we said that since major targets stand below the, this low, then probably market will not limit just the 618 retracement of that counter trend move, but sh but probably will continue move to the downside. That has happened. Market now renew the lows. From that pattern, A, B, C top, 1618 target stands in agreement with the 886 support 133.71, oh, sorry, 132.71, right here. From the other point of view, market now stands right at the 1618 extension of the butterfly, and that is the most common area of the triggering of the butterfly buying pattern. So the, here, some retracement could start to the upside. Also, you can see that some hint on the potential bullish divergence with the MACD indicator right at the target of the butterfly. Also, this long dash green line is the monthly period support one area, 132.94, it's right here. On the hourly time frame, what do we see? Another butterfly is developing currently. 127 target of this butterfly stands a bit lower than 1618 extension on the 4 hour time frame. It's 132.94 in agreement with the monthly pivot support 1. 1618 extension 
stands right at the area of the 88 support on the daily time frame in agreement with the 1618 target uh, of the ABCD pattern on the 4 hour time frame from that pattern. Okay. Hourly trend now is bearish, but you can see also, although there is now crossing of the MACD lines, you see that market give us some hint that probably this could be the bullish divergence with this low. So that is the context for the short term potential buy pattern. It's a bit, uh, we do not know, will market continue to that area or will trigger the retracement and start some retracement right from that area. The distance between that is about 40 pips. So I think that this is logical. Uh, if you are a scalp trader and you would like to trade these patterns on the hourly time frame on the long side of the market, well, um, you could try to, probably it's better to try to enter from that area with the stops placed below that area. This will be logical. Because if market will break that area right to the downside, the next target will be 132.42. This is the daily, daily 100% extension from that ABC pattern, ABC top, D point, 132.42. Maybe even it makes sense to place stop even below 132.42 target on the daily time frame because this uh, increases the probability of respect of that area and that market could show some at least um, shallow retracement. From the another point of view, if you will wait for the entering from that area or even from 132.42 area, then probably you will skip the, this trade if market will reverse from that level. So that is just up to you how you will enter. Probably you could try to enter partially. For instance, the small lot from that area, then add some more from that area. And then, if one market still will reach 132.42, enter additionally from the uh, target of the ABCD pattern on the daily time frame. But uh, I think that market still could show some retracement from that level or from that level before it will reach the target of the ABCD pattern on the, out, uh, on the daily time frame. Because some patterns uh, have the finished points right around 133. So, that is um, some riddle that uh, you could you, you will have to uh, resolve. You, you will have to answer on that questions by yourself because uh, this is very personal from uh, the context of the trading from the uh, money management system that you apply. So decide that's your choice. But probably I think that if you would like to trade on Friday patrons, it probably makes sense to enter from that area with the place stop just below it. If you are a day trader and uh, you trade on the daily time frame, then you should not enter on the short, on the long side of the market. Even if market will show some retracement due to that pattern, you should use it for the entry on the short side of the market. Because daily trend is bearish and your context for trading is the bearish. I just uh, talk about this hourly patterns for those who trade on intraday charts and probably this could be interesting for them. Well. That's our current view on the situation. Let's take a look and keep a look on that area, that area, and that area to potential buy patterns, buy signals in that levels because there are two butterflies, different butterflies uh, are finished in that area. Also, market give us some, uh, gives us some, some hint about on the potential MACD divergence right at the points of the butterflies completion. So that is not bad context to try to enter on the long side of the market. Uh, but this trade should be very fast and with the nearest target uh, should be applied since this is just a retracement because daily trend is currently uh, bearish and our um, medium, term, medium term target is around 128. So that's just scalp intraday trade could be done by, by these patterns.